Hello everyone, this is Neha Talwar from Learn Science with Neha and today we have got a special guest with us, Master Garvit. Hello Garvit, how are you? I am fine, thank you. So today we are going to do certain fun experiments which kids love to do and they are always excited to see the results. So without wasting time, let's start with the first experiment for which we require an egg. So this egg, Garvit, put in a vinegar solution. For how many days did you put it, Garvit? Two days. So Garvit put this egg into two days and slowly after two days, when he took out the egg, this egg changed to, what did you see here? Crazy ball. So this egg changed to a crazy ball. See here, we have got this egg and this egg can bounce. It has become a crazy ball. Now comes the scientific logic. Why did it happen? Why kids had fun with this egg? Logic is when you put this egg in a vinegar, egg has got this hard shell. This hard shell is made up of calcium carbonate and vinegar basically is an acetic acid. So when calcium carbonate reacts with an acetic acid, Slowly, carbon will start dissolving and will form carbon dioxide gas. You can see the vapors coming out from carbon dioxide. These vapors will keep on coming for two days till the time this complete shell is being dissolved. After the shell is being dissolved, this egg will turn to a bouncy ball. See this bouncy ball? Now, fact number two about the egg. Can you see the size difference? Which egg is bigger, Garvit? Bouncy ball. This bouncy ball egg is big, which again creates a fun for the kids. But again, scientific reason why this egg is big. Another process that is called as osmosis. What happens if you put two things, one is in more water, one is in less water, then water will start flowing from higher concentration towards lower concentration. Same happened when you put it in vinegar. Vinegar had more water than the water which was there in an egg. So this water will start entering into the egg through this small semi-permeable membrane and slowly the egg will increase in size and will swell. So that's why it has got bigger size. Now we have got fact number three about the egg. What is that fact? When you boil an egg, you might have seen Garvit, your mom put some salt in the egg water? Yes. Why? Because the egg white becomes hard and stiff if you put it in hot saline water rather than you put it in fresh water which will prevent the egg from bursting in the water and you can have a complete boiled egg in your breakfast. So this is all. Now what I want from you all kiddos I want you to perform the same experiment with coke and keep it for two days and with orange juice and share your results in my comment box which is below. So see you with the results. Let's start with the next fun experiment. So to start with we have got a magic in which we will blow a balloon without using our mouth and this will be done by Garvit. So Garvit, tell me what do you want first? Vinegar. Okay, we are having vinegar first and then? Baking soda. Baking soda, okay. One bottle. One bottle, glass bottle we have taken. And one balloon. And balloon. In balloon we have already put some baking soda. So what now we will do? We will put some vinegar here in this bottle. And we will invert this balloon on the mouth of this bottle. Let's see what happens. And it will be followed by another fun experiment. Just keep watching. The fun, it will happen. Garvit, can you please help me to pull it up? Ooh, wow. Look at the balloon, how it is getting inflated. Ooh, it's becoming bigger and bigger. So this is fun. Now comes the logic again. Why it happened? So the logic is when you mix vinegar with baking soda, a reaction occurs which is called as brisk effervescence 
Can you see these bubbles coming out and a hissing sound? During this hissing sound, a gas is also being evolved and that gas is carbon dioxide. This carbon dioxide is the product of the reaction which is being happening in this bottle. Now we have got this carbon dioxide which is filled here in this balloon. Now I will take out this balloon slowly. Oh, Garvit, can you please pass me some napkin? So now, what will I do? I will open the mouth of this balloon when I will ignite this matchstick and you will see the matchstick will extinguish it will stop burning again a magic but with the logic let's see Garvit can you please hold it from here so that air should not pass I will light because this is not something which kids can do so I will do it so now slowly I will open the mouth of this in front of this Look, this had stopped burning. Oxygen is a gas which supports combustion. Anything which burns, that burns only with the help of oxygen. But carbon dioxide never supports combustion. What carbon dioxide do? Carbon dioxide will form a blanket around the thing which is being fired and will cut the supply of oxygen to that thing. So once the oxygen supply is cut, the substance which, is, which has caught fire will extinguish. This is why carbon dioxide is also put in fire extinguishers which can help while uh, when there's a burning, when any building catches fire. So we put a big spray of carbon dioxide which will cut the supply of oxygen and will, uh, the fire will extinguish after some time. So this was a fun experiment which was accompanied by scientific logic. So I would like you to all please like, comment and subscribe to my channel. I would love to see your feedbacks in my comment box. So Garvit, any message for the audience? Do they? Subscribe on my channel. Yeah, they should subscribe on our channel. Have fun and keep doing science experiments in your daily life. Bye. Bye. Bye.